Hello friends, welcome. So in the previous video we worked with uh, categories. We can create and we display all the categories here. Also we can edit and let's delete here. Good. Now let's work with posts. For posts we need the category ID, so we need a belong to relationship. We need the title, the slug, the content and the is published and also I'm going to upload images for this purpose. So to upload images I'm going to install the SPAD media library and if you go to the filament plugins here let's uh, filter by name SPATI and I'm going to use this SPATI media library by filament visit the site and let's install composer require go to the terminal paste that in hit enter next copy this one you need to publish the migration so copy this and paste that in and we need to run the php artisan migrate so artisan migrate okay now we have the media table in our database good now we need to prepare our model so if we click here and open the spotty documentation for laravel media library we need to add implements as media in the in our model and also use interacts with media so let's open the post model and let's do the same thing implements as media so implements as media and also interacts with media interacts with media okay let's save it close this one and that's it let's close also this page now let's go in the form components and the table columns so let's go first for form components and we need to add this spotty media library file upload or we can use also the collection if you have learned how we, we can use the spotty media library i have a full tutorial in this uh, channel so let's go in the filament post resource and here we need to create our form we need to add our fields so i'm going to open first the category resource and i'm going to copy what we have in the form here so card make schema i'm going to copy also the card and paste it in the post resource we, we need to import the card so filament forms components card also text input the str and also the closure if you don't have now here we have a text input make title and the slug is okay we need the if you go here to the documentation and go to the form builder we we need a select for the relationship belongs to so here we have make status make author id but we need belong to select and let's use this one i'm going to copy this and i'm going to add in the first place this one import the belong to select and we need not author id but uh, category id relation is category and yeah we need the name for the category next we need a content so i'm going to use a rich text editor so let's go and see what we have in the field 
uh, rich editor here let's copy this one and add it import the rich editor and the last one i'm going to use we need to use a checkbox or toggle what you want so if you want toggle here is i'm going to use this one or use the checkbox now let's add that toggle here import and say not it is admin but is published save it now uh, we need to add to the product that casts so let's copy and open the post model and paste that in protected casts and not is admin but i'm going to say is published okay now if i come here and refresh let's go to the new post here is our four the category id title slug content and is published which is toggled let's create one post for the laravel and i'm going to say laravel post add something here they published and let's say create and the post created and we are in the edit now let's go and create one more i'm going to say tailwin css tailwin css post i'm going to say okay let's add something here published and let's say create now let's display the id and what we can display other so i want to display the id the title the slug maybe and is published or not so we need to go in the table builder columns first for text column i'm going to copy what we have in the category resource here let's copy this and paste it here down there in the columns let's display the id and make it sortable import the text column also the title uh, the slug and i'm going to display also the is published to see if that is published or not so to display the is published i'm going to say boolean column here and let's copy that one and paste it here import the boolean column and not is featured but is published david let's go and see now what we have in the post yeah here we have the id the title the slug and is published is uh, green now if i click here and make this unpublished save go back we can see is red very good now if you want to display also the image let's go here to the spotty media library and go to the table columns and here we can display that so copy and uh, paste it here import the spotty media library make this not avatar but i'm going to say thumbnail save and now when we create it i'm going to add with collection so let's copy and let's add before the rich editor paste that in import and say make not avatar but make thumbnail the collection is going to be 
posts, save, go to the browser and if I refresh, here we have thumbnail but we don't have for this shoe. Let's go and create new post and now we have this thumbnail here. So let's select the Vue.js, uh, I'm going to say Vue.js post, choose a file and I'm going to choose a Vue.js here. Let's add something. Let's make this published and create. Now if I go here and what we, why we don't see that? Post, thumbnail, thumbnail and we need to say collection, the B post. Okay, save it, refresh, and now we see the Vue.js. Let's go and add also for Laravel and Tailwind CSS. So here we have the browser, add the Laravel PNG, open, make published, and you see here, okay, the next one is for Tailwind CSS, edit, add file, I have here Tailwind CSS open, uploading, now save, go back to the post and here it is. We have all the posts with uh, images. Very good. Now let's work with tags because it's the same as the categories and let's go in the category. Let's copy this. Copy this go to the tag resource and paste it down there. I think I don't have copy that. So copy and paste it. Why? Again for last time, copy and paste it here. Okay. Let's import. We need the ID, name and Slack, okay, save it. Now let's copy also the card because the same is we need the name and the Slack. So copy that, go to the tag resource, paste that in, hit save. We need to import the card. Okay, we need to import the text input. We need to import the closure and the SDR. Okay, let's save it and let's see now. Go to the tags. We don't have any tags. Let's create one. Uh, Laravel. I'm going to say just a table. Let's say eloquent component. Now let's go to the tags and we see why we see only one. Ah, because we updated, I forgot. Uh, the same thing, I'm going to go in the category resources and in the create, let's copy this one because I forget we are in the edit mode. Go now to the tag resources and create tag paste that in. So we are going to modify the return direct to the index page and go and create new tag. So table, create, now we are back, create new tag, eloquent, and here we are. Okay friends, so now we have the resources for tags, posts, and categories. Hope you understand and hope you like if you like like the video subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one all the best friends thank you very much